Hello, it's Jason Payne for Cold Banker Dan Hopper Realtor. Well, I'm back at probably my favorite community in New Braunfels, Vintage Oaks, in the Grove section. And the reason I'm out here is I have clients getting ready to close on this house behind me, built by Perry Homes. It is their 2738 plan, and it turned out pretty neat. Let's go check it out. My clients were able to build this house from scratch and be able to pick out all their own color designs. And uh, it's rather nice. I do love this community out here, Vintage Oaks. Uh, as I'm filming this, it is 5 June 2022. A little warm out today. We're in the mid 90s. Just drove by the uh, fitness center. Saw a lot of people out hanging out by the pool. And if you haven't seen my amenities tour of this place, the Lazy River is absolutely gorgeous. I do come out here on occasion to spend time with my family. Uh, I don't live here but I know I've sold enough out here that I can find it on occasion. But this is a beautiful home. Uh, square footage is what's in the column, well, what's in the name, 2738 square feet. Let's head on inside. Loving this door. Right when you come in, you notice it's got wide hallways, fairly tall ceilings, different, uh, Got the shelf ceiling in there. You do have your office right up front. They want a very dark blue, almost black tile throughout the house, very modern. Till they do need to get some touch up paint work done, they're finishing that up. That's gonna be done prior to closing. Like I said, this, um, this is Sunday. I like to do my video, my follow-up tours on Sunday when no construction people are out. So this will be the office. And then you come around, like I said, really wide hallways. And you've got some bedrooms that are kind of by the front part of the house. Sorry, I'm gonna mess up the freshly paint uh, vacuum carpet. But I wanna show off the closet space in this house. A super tall doors. These are good sized rooms. They did go for like the in-house, the whole house vacuum shop thing, so they could just hook the hose up and use that. You've got Ethernet ports uh, throughout. The other bedroom. It's going to be a very energy efficient house. I'll go ahead and show you this closet too. All right, let's see. This is going to be kind of your open to the public shower, bathroom. Love the color selection. All right, before we go to the main living room area, I want to show you this direction because you have another bedroom tucked away over here. And this bedroom is going to have its own private bath. Real similar to one we just saw, but it does have a tub in it. Perfect for little kiddos. You have to have a, at least one tub in any bathroom or else you're risking any potential resale value because you got to have a bathtub for the kiddos. Once again, that whole house vacuum system is set up with their ethernet ports. All right, this also has, we had an office up front. This is more of a flex space where you can close the, uh, close these doors and have this as a little media room, a uh, game room, whatever you want to use it for, or another office. So if you've got two folks doing the stay at home uh, office working, that works just fine for it. Every person can have their own office. All right, let's check out the main living space. Notice lots of lighting in here. Love the tall windows that Perry puts in their homes. Beautifully done, uh, contrasting light and really dark. Gotta point out with Perry, this is one of the things I like to do with the under the cabinet storage. 
No wasted space here. We got beautiful uh, countertop for the island. Well, the stainless steel sink, but not a 50-50 sink. Y'all know how I feel about those. We can't put a skillet in, it's worthless. Now, Perry didn't have the option for, they wanted to do their own pendant lighting, so they got them pre-wired for pendant lights. So, given the, my clients will now be able to choose their own. Here's another example of that whole home vacuum. See underneath there, what they can do if they're sweeping up, they can sweep it close to that, open that up, and it'll just suck the dust, dirt away. Here's the pantry. And this is a gas community. So you do have your five burner gas cooktop. Your microwave oven and your regular oven. And this does, it is uh, being able to connect to your Wi-Fi. And I think there's a port in here somewhere, maybe not. But you can hook this up to your Wi-Fi and uh, get your oven heated before you come home, which is really nice. This space right in front of us here will be your breakfast nook area, which is also plenty enough size to use a, as your formal dining room space. Spot for if you want to put a chandelier there, it's pre-wired, so my clients can now take their time, shop for the right lighting that fits their needs, and probably get for a little cheaper than what the builder would sell it for. All right, let's head on outside. They took the same dark tones out to the patio area. Like I said, pre-wired. They can put a biggest fan as they want to and get it pre-wired. We do have electrical outlets. And I almost forgot to mention this whole wall door is open. That's a, that's a nice upgrade cost-wise. But man, during the fall and spring when the weather's nice, well, really all winter long, uh, they can have this whole door open and really extend their living space and I really embrace enjoying being out here. That is Highway 46. Well, uh, not a full highway, but uh, you are gonna have traffic. You are gonna hear some road noise out here. But my clients are aware of that. Plum, plum for gas, so they can make this their outdoor kitchen area. So that could be really nice. Once again, something you do after the fact. But it's a really good size yard. And this oak tree is not on their property, but man, they certainly do get to use it because that's a beautiful looking tree. All right. They did get this pre-wired for, uh, well, wired already for in-ground outlets. So if you got your electric couches, or if you just have your nightstand sitting there, it's good to be able to plug stuff in without wires showing. Speaking of wires showing, they did opt for getting this pass through, which I highly recommend because you can have your big flat screen TV up there and no wires showing. Perry does use a Nest smart home system. This is gonna be your utility room washer and dryer hookups and into the owner suite a very spacious owner suite I said they just went for the builders grade light because they're gonna put their own fan in after the fact still lots of lighting in here plenty of space there's that vacuum cleaner port but check out this bathroom Love their tile selection for the floor. Beautiful soaking tub. Got nice glass that you can't see through. We do have different vanity spots. Another spot for that vacuum. I don't know, I'm pointing that out a lot, but yeah, you can sweep up and just open it up. Your linen closet. 
love this big shower. Now for my clients, when they watch this, you definitely gonna want a water softener because we do have hard water here and that hard water will show on this, on the black tile there. So getting a water softener early will be a huge advantage for keeping that looking as it does right now. We have a really nice size closet. And there's your water closet. Eight foot doors throughout the house. If you're gonna have a house with tall ceilings, should definitely have eight foot doors because it really looks nice. Like I said, this whole wall here will open up. Well, at least it should. I'm trying to figure out where they're gonna be put in the pocket. Or maybe just these two doors will open up. So I could be wrong, but now, now I'm looking at it from this side, it looks like those two doors open. I don't know if there's enough of a cavity in here for everything. Yeah, I don't see a cavity. So it's not gonna all open up, but you do, these two doors here will open up. Just wanna make sure I'm putting the right information out there. All right, let's gonna wrap a tour of this beautiful Perry home. Remember, it, this is the 2738S plan, and this is built for my clients. I'm super excited for them. I'm really thankful they used me as their realtor. And if you're looking for a realtor in the area, feel free to click the link in the description box. That's gonna give you access to my calendar uh, to schedule either a Zoom meeting or a phone call with me. I'll be happy to help. And please don't go through this process out using a realtor because it doesn't cost you anything to use a realtor on the buy side. So if you got nothing to lose, reach out to me. Uh, if you like this video, hit that like button. And of course, subscribe to my channel. And as always, keep sharing these videos with your friends and family. All right, take care now. Bye.